that is the Bailey Gap shelter mile marker 660.6 .6. and I'm gonna check it out because we're doing 18 miles today and I want to minimize a lot of stops so there's a lot of these rocks like fortification almost along the ridge we had seen a lot of them yesterday too very rocky I have to watch your step I think that's why my feet yesterday were all feeling like they were beat up because of all these rocks I have to be mindful where I step This is the war spur shelter. Right on the trail. What shelter are we going to? Um Laurel Creek shelter. Laurel Creek? Mm-hmm. Somebody forgot their coat. Looks like a cl clean shelter. I don't know how many people will stay here though. It's pretty close to the road. What? Look at that. They have a nice little bench. Great goose. I don't know who that is. Is there any recent? 322 was Great Goose. Oh, okay. So no one we know stayed here. Uh, March 4th, Anita. Oh, Anita was here. He had a nap here. He napped here? Yeah, it says he had a great nap. Yeah, Anita is now in Pennsylvania. He's actually ahead of everyone now. He passed Bennett. Anyway, we have to get going. We have six more miles to go. Yeah. Yeah, we're actually going slow today because, uh, man, the terrain is unforgiving. Lots of uh, rocky ridges and steep downhill. So that's where we're going. Laurel Creek Shelter, 5.9 miles. I don't think we cross, honey. Huh? Just go straight. You don't cross. Okay. Well, we cross on the bridge. Still looking for fish. <laughs> Little big ones in here, but probably not none. We're gonna get to the shelter at night probably. We started late today while well, I slept a little bit, slept in. And then the terrain was a little 
difficult. Lots of uh, rocky ridges, steep downhill with lots of rocks, lots of blowdowns. And of course, our pack's a little bit heavier because of uh, a resupply. So yeah, we're hiking a little bit slower, but that's why you had headlamps, right? Good morning. It's Friday the 24th, I think. Uh, this is the shelter we stayed at last night, the Laurel Creek shelter. Uh, we got here quite late. Um, it's a really nice shelter. There are no mice. And um, <clears throat> we thought we were the only ones here, but a couple of section hikers were actually camped in the back. Jeff said the freebie is not <laughs> as the other ones. <laughs> How would you describe the freebie? Uh, he will pass that one. Okay, it's just it's kind of nasty. Yeah, so I didn't go. So we're gonna go to Nidei's shelter, which is uh, 12.6 miles, and um, it's supposed to rain this morning. Not sure if it's still the case, but um, the rest of the day is supposed to be. Warmer, high of 67. Anyway, we'll try to take some videos. There are supposed to be some views on our way to our destination today. trail is definitely changing. We see more vegetation sprouting, birds singing, and bugs. There were lots of bugs yesterday. Um, mosquitoes, gnats. Looks like we're approaching a, a road here. I think this road, if you head east, it will take you to Blacksburg, Virginia. Finally see fishes? Oh, all kinds of them. <laughs> Finally. I'm down some of the They're up under the bridge. They see me, look at them over here. They're over here. See them all? Well, you missed them. 
You're just too slow. Yeah, wait, you see them down there? Right in front of that bush. There's a bunch of little ones. Oh, yeah, I see them. I bet you there's a lot of fishes in. Well, they got a big pond down there, too, so I bet they do. I bet they saw it. I have to say, after yesterday's difficult terrain, this is like oh, this ther is so therapeutic. <laughs> My feet are loving this. Yes. Oh yeah. Butterfly. So there's this giant oak and a cow was trying to scratch his neck. Her. Or her neck. I'm gonna try to take a video of this oak. <laughs> Miss Cow. Look at her, she's looking at me, like, goodbye cow. What? I was wondering if they were supposed to be over here because it looks like there was some kind of like, they might have taken it down though. It looks like there was some kind of like stuff put up here to keep the cows on that side. Oh. So that looks like a perfect scratch spot there that cow found. Yeah, looks like that cow is oh, having yeah, a good time. Look at it from this back here, Milo. Oh my god. <laughs> uh oh, you got somebody coming after you. Uh, looking at her baby. It's gonna go back over there, I think. Zero breeze, huh? I know,
Oh, he was waiting for us to die or what? <laughs> Do we look that bad? Do we smell that bad? <laughs> Mistake number three. Man, look at him go. Well, the nets finally gave up. We have been going through this side of this mountain with lots of rocks to climb. And I don't know if you can see, but that whole edge there is all rock. It's pretty cool though. Now there's two of them. And we have more of these ledges. They're like never ending and it's hot. So I'm complaining. <laughs> I don't like it when it's very hot. But anyway, have to get going. Mexico, head that way, 1920 miles. Atlantic Ocean is that way. <laughs> 